Hi there, I'm Andy Hillier and today's guitar lesson is going to be on A Quiet Time from Red Dead Redemption 2. I've done a cover version of it so if you want to hear what it sounds like all the way through check that out, I'll leave a link in the description and a card above. In this lesson I'm going to teach you how to play it. Just before I do though, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel which is Andy Hillier, give me a like on the video, leave me some comments in the comment section including any songs you want to learn, where in the world you're from and if you love what I'm doing and you want to support me, keep me doing these videos and you'd like to print the tabs off for this I'll put it on my Patreon page, I'll leave a link in the description. My guitar's in standard tuning for this one. Uh, the first line sounds like this. So we're going to start off by playing E3. And then we keep that down, but put a finger on A2. And you're going to play the A, D, G and the B strings. And instead of just playing them all at the same time, kind of like arpeggiate them slowly, so like this. And then we're going to play the A string, and then we're playing an A chord, which is D2, G2, and B2, and the open E string. So you can either play it like finger style, or you could play it with a plectrum as well. And then into bar five, we've just got an E minor chord. And again, let's just arpeggiate that like. So the whole line will go. Hold that on, and then we go to the next line. Uh, and it actually starts on beat two, so there's one, two, three, four. So we're playing A2 and D2. And then we're gonna do this a lot. We're gonna bend uh, the A5 just a little bit out of tune. So it's one, two, three, four. And then this next part, let me just quickly play it for you guys. Okay, so bar eight, we play D2, D5 bending a bit out of tune, back to D2, a little pull off from G3 to G2, back to a D5. So bars eight and nine together go. Into bar 10, we play a D2, then a G2, to A5. So bar 10 goes and then into bar 11 we play A2, G2, A2 and then A5. Let me just play you bars 8, 9, 10 and 11. We've got and slowly that would be Bar 12 is the same as bar 8. Uh, so dun, dun. And then play D2, so we're into bar 13 now. D2, G2, A2, A5. So that. Or up speed. And then bar 14, we're going to play D2, G2, open E. And then take the finger up to play A2, G2, and E. So it goes. And then you're going to play into the next bar, bar 15. We've got D2, A2, and then A5. So let's play bars 8 through to 15. Here we go. Okay, and then that repeats round, and it actually repeats round three times, and we play bar 15, the first and the second time. On the third time round, uh, from bar 8, we go along up to bar 14, and then jump to bar 16, that goes... Which is D2, D2, D2 sliding up to fret 5, and then G2, so... And then we get on to the next line. Uh, it sounds like this. So 
So you're playing the E string, you don't have to play the E string at the same time if you don't want to, but I, I put it in. E string and then G2, you bend it up and drop it back down like this, at the same time as an E string. And it does that again in the next bar, and in the next bar, and then you play a D5, so it goes one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and then you're playing A, oh, sorry, D2 into bar 20, A2, then A5. So the first four bars of that line go two, three, four, two, three, four, and then in bar 21 I've got an E string and D2 at the same time, D5, so you've got bar 22 goes, which is D2, G4, A2, A5, and then bar 23 is just D2, G2, and then another G2, so, and bar 24 just goes, which is D2, D2, D5, G2. So let's play that uh, line along. Uh, so up from bar 17 to bar 24, here we go. One, two, three, four, two, three, four, two, three, four. And then it repeats back to bar 17, play 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 20, doesn't do 24, it jumps over that and plays 25, which plays A2 on beat two and then A5 on beat four, one, two, three, four. So hopefully that makes sense. You play uh, the first eight bars and then you repeat back, play the first seven bars and play the last bar instead. And then we get to the next line. Uh, which is very similar to the second line that we played. Slight change, you've got... Uh, so we're playing D2, D5, D2, open D. So that's a slight change there. B, uh, sorry, G3 pulling off to G2 and then D5 bent up. So the first two bars of the line go. And then in the next bar, uh, G2, no, sorry, D2, and then G2, and A5, so one, two, three, and then A2, G2, A2, and then A5. Uh, let's just play the first four bars of that line. A one, two, three, four. Uh, then the next two, four bars are pretty much the same as what we did in the second line. Musical. So from bar 30. And the next line uh, is uh, the same kind of thing again. So it's just slowly that'll be... So very similar kind of idea, slight variation. And then the last line, uh, this is like the third line that we did. So it goes. So same idea of what we've done. Uh, so slowly that'll be like. repeats back and plays bars 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, then jumps over and just plays uh, in bar 50 a D2 to finish. So hopefully that's all made sense. So let's put it all together uh, and see how it works.
enjoyed this little guitar lesson? If you have, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, which is Andy Hillier, give me a like on the video, leave me some comments in the comment section, including any songs you want to learn, where in the world you're from. And if you love what I'm doing and you want to support me, keep me doing these videos. I've got a Patreon page. All the proceeds just help support me, keep me doing these videos. Thanks for watching this. I've been Andy Hillier and I'll see you next time.